Hey guys, so today I want to check out the brand new version here of uh, Android and 4.4.4 KitKat here uh, on the OnePlus One smartphone, which actually did bring some new calibration, display calibration, uh, which is pretty interesting. But um, yeah, I got it as an over the air update basically here to my OnePlus One phone. Uh, so you can first of all see here if I go into settings, I go down here. Uh, it's Android 4.4.4 of Synergy mode here. Uh, you can see here Synergy mode 11, of course. Uh, so the new updates is you first of all if you have new versions of uh, all of the Google apps I also think that we might see a new page in here. I don't think it looks exactly like this Of course minor bug tweaks uh, elements and things like that across the uh, the UI I also heard that the qual call quality should be way better uh, They seem to be adding a clear image um, and as I said, updated uh, the most of the Google apps should be using the latest version here, which definitely is quite nice. Uh, new colder calibration for the screen. Maybe you can go into settings and um, tweak that. And I'm not really sure, it's probably a little bit hard to see here, but uh, definitely is a difference that you will see the first time uh, you check it out. Uh, some other things here, proximity sensor prevents now activation of off-screen gestures while in your pocket. Uh, capacitive touch key supported in recovery mode, so that can definitely be nice if you do use that a lot. Um, and then of course we do have some other updates here. Increased capacity button illumination. So let's see here. These buttons down here, uh, they had a pretty poor, pretty poor, it was hard to see them. So maybe they have changed that. Uh, the button should be in here somewhere. Hmm, buttons. Okay, maybe this is not the button. Enable, okay, there we go. So let's see, can I see a difference? No, they are still pretty dark, which uh, which kind of sucks. Uh, sucks that it's so dark down here. Wow, I almost find it kind of feel kind of. I don't remember exactly how you navigate when I have these buttons. Oh, there we go. We have the multitasking suite. Uh, some other things here: improved overall stability, fixed issues with vibration, uh, this uh, being disabled during, during quiet hours, uh, fixed lock screen not updating to track information during music playback, fixed microphone volume for all formats, in voice recorder app, so better voice recorder app, which is also nice. Uh, also fixed, okay, Google not triggering voice search in Google Now, so we should be able to use that if I use the connect to Wi-Fi here. Hmm, type in password. I guess I need to restart my router, but I'm not sure if I want to do that right now. Hmm, no. Okay, there we go, connected. What's up? Here are the listings for Avnira and Copic. What is 5 minus 8? Five 5 eighths, a player positioned between the scrum half and the three quarters. Sweet, so that one is also working. Fixed Picasso sync, fixed battery present not updating in uh, custom lock screens. Okay, that's nice. Fixed camera, 
gesture activating lock screen instead of trigger on camera and also fix the wallpaper is not applying in full screen taking wrong size when cropping etc so i've seen it sometimes when i've been changing wallpapers or something uh, that it's became weird in the background uh, but now they might have fixed that which definitely is a nice little addition here so overall quite a nice update that you really want to have so yeah quick look here on the oneplus one have a nice make